In this video, I show you how to fix jar files not opening with Java. If you found this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. Not being able to run a Java or jar file is extremely annoying, so let's get into some fixes. It's important to note as well is that your Java or jar file may be either blank, it may have another app's logo, or it may even have the coffee logo. It doesn't matter, this guide should go and fix it. So let's get into a few different fixes, so make sure to watch this full guide so you know everything. Firstly, just make sure you've actually got Java installed. So firstly, we're gonna do this, go and open up our web browser. For example, I'll use Google Chrome, you can use any. Go to a search engine, and what we need to do is either go to java.com or just go and search for Java. And make sure you go to the official website. Then what you need to do is just go and tap on download Java like so, or you can go to the top left and tap on download as well. And yeah, just go and press on download Java like this. The download will then begin and wait for it to finish and then we can go and find the download in our file explorer. Here's the Java installer, so to install it all you need to do is go and double tap on it like so, you'll then probably get a Windows cootie pop up which unfortunately I can't go and show you. And that's it guys, all you need to do is go through with the Java setup, go and tap install and it's then going to go and install. The next thing you need to do is come back to the jar or Java file which you want to go and run and go and click on it once and then right click on it and then go down and hover over open with and then go over and if you've got the option for Java TM platform SE binary, click on it or go and tap on choose another app if it isn't there. Then what you can do is go and find these apps here, scroll down and maybe in the more options and then you can go and find Java and then what you want to do is press always and then it should go and run. However, if that still isn't working, there's something else we can go and do. So come back to your web browser and then go to a search engine. Then what you need to do is go and search for something called Jarfix. You spell that J-A-R-F-I-X. And so what Jarfix is going to go and do is go and actually make sure that Java files are open using Java and not other applications like they probably are right now or even nothing happens. So go and search for Jarfix and this is the official website you want to go to. Just be aware of any unofficial websites and here it is. And then scroll down to where it says the solution and it says you can fix this problem with easy but the small reliable jarfix.exe program. So go and click on it like so and it will then download. Then what we need to do is go and open up our file explorer and go and run this. So here is Jarfix and all you need to do is go and double click on it like so. You'll then get a Windows QD pop up and it'll then say the .jar suffix has been successfully registered. And there we go, you can then press OK and then what you need to do is it may be worth restarting your computer and then once you've done that, come back to the jar file which you want to go and run, right click on it and press open with and then you should go and see the Java TM platform as a binary option or go and tap on choose another app and then go and find Java where maybe in the more options list here and then press always run and hopefully it will then run. Mine should now and just like that, I think it's gone and run. There we go guys. If you found this useful, please consider leaving a like. Peace.